since I last posted an actual update about our house anyway welcome to my world my name is Lin Zabu if it's your first time to see me make sure you stay I feel sun-kissed today um, today uh, I'm going to be showing you another 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 huge update you won't believe how beautiful our kitchen is but first I want to show you all the other updates that we have about the house and this video is also to say thank you so much to all the people who have been contributing towards this house all the people that have developed this house very yo I am speechless welcome to the new subscribers hope you keep subscribing and to my returning subscriber you guys are amazing by the way it's been forever since i last tried a wig so let me know in the in the comment section how i look if i should keep wigs off or if i should you know keep the wigs on anyway let's get into the video um so a few days ago we had to make um the gate adjustments because you can see all the concrete that was in the sand i mean the cement was very very little so every time i was opening the gate it was falling off almost you know like it was really really difficult so they have put uh, new poles here you can see they are still very very new and uh, yeah so the gate is just helping me survive <laughs> you know to help my hands not to go anywhere uh, so this is what has been happening with the updates you see the gate needs painting but we already have the paint thank god so we are going to be doing the painting anytime soon See guys, our sugar cane is growing so fast. I don't know who wants to join us in the in the sugar cane. And then there was a guy um, who was very very interested in me doing this farming thing. You can see it's really looking nice. It's really looking healthy. All the things that we've planted are looking very very beautiful. Anyway. So, um, since you guys last saw the updates, many of you are asking me for the updates. So here we are. I'm going to be showing you all the updates that you need. All the updates that you need. But here we go. We have, um, here we go. We have developments. Our hen house is here. Let me show you. I like it because it's really, really very pretty and small. I put the coffee husks down so that I don't have to clean it up every day. And also so that this coffee husks can suck out the water that usually come with the chicken poop. And then I have this which I always hang up here for the chicken to eat. This is how it's looking from up above. And yeah basically that's the whole um the whole thing of how it looks unfortunately we lost one of the kachik yes the ones that we got a bit last week 
unfortunately we lost one of them so now we only have that one left the, there were two so unfortunately they both fell into the pit latrine we picked <laughs> fortunately we saved both of them but the other got sick and uh, unfortunately passed on or passed died now we only have this one remaining let's pray it survived and guys today was washing day that's why you see all my clothes up so today was washing day that's why you see everything is outside i have other people working here I'll tell you the story about the doors working up here. But the main focus today is going to be our house again. So, this is how beautiful our kitchen is looking, guys. I mean, we finally managed to get the glasses for the kitchen window. They only need cleaning. <laughs> they only need cleaning, guys. Um, you can see where we're hanging our plates. I think everything is coming along very well. This is our sink. I needed a deep, big sink, so we got it. Yeah. And these bottles, I'm keeping them because of Sarah Pedun. She taught me how to keep little plants in the little bottle. <laughs> Yeah, so we are able to open the kitchen window like that and see outside from here. So I think it's looking really, really nice, guys. We will do the final touches later, like the water connection. We have our gas, of course, as always. I bought like big tiles. I wanted to get the... Um, there's those other things that they get, but I felt so... I got the up top uh, tiles, the work top tiles which are bigger and better. So you can see it is all coming out together like perfectly. So these were supposed, these tiles were supposed to be for here, but fortunately I got a bit extra. So we put them down so we have enough storage. And they are. <laughs> There is a kahol here. I think my only mistake being my own architecture was not knowing where the gas cylinder will sit properly. So I put it in the corner, like in the deep corner there. You can't even see it. And then the rat takes advantage and hides here. Basically the gas cylinder is down, but there. So. We can see everything is coming along very well. <laughs> and of course, this is our fridge as always. Um, yeah, that, that is how it is all looking together. So I removed the carpet. If you've been watching, you know that we had a carpet down. But we had to remove the carpet because there's a lot of work going on right now. So still, everything is still everywhere still everything is still just a mess so let me take you just upstairs to show you the other development that we have hard clap for me and clap for us so yes you see this is the extension that we made there's a lot of rough work there is something that needs to be put here but it will be put because this one has dried up so now our extension is here guys you see so this is going to be our space for the wardrobe but right now i'm using it as storage for things that i easily use when my brothers come I can easily find them a place to sleep. So that's why I keep the extra mattress here closed. And of course we also have the um, the window there. So everything is looking so nice. Then we have this little thing of ours called the bathroom. But uh, it needs to be worked on and uh, you guys don't know how grateful I am. So they had to put hardcore 
on the on the metal because now when I step on like this then it doesn't make the sound it was making after they have put the concrete so you guys can all agree with me that uh, we've done a very great job I can't thank you enough so we are going to put here mirrors and then we put here a door and then I'll have a bigger room then this bed will be turned like this so that I can access the window properly so when I was coming into the house you saw people making new doors and new window let me show you why so this window opens like that and to be quite honest with you it is very heavy like really 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 heavy so also if the wind is too much you see how it is shaking it can easily fall down so basically that's why they are making a new window because this one is very bad the people i gave the job to do see see the view i'm going to be having guys after <laughs> from my bed this is the view i get you know so anyway you see these other additional things basically this was very rough work and the work is looking very ugly like see here eh? the work is not looking neat at all like see here meanwhile this is like they have worked on this window for like um three four times you know and it still failed now that's a mosquito net there but it still you see the gap up even here see the gap like this so it's not um, making sense, it's not, Ooh, I'm sweating because it's very hot and that's the other reason as to why they're making a new window because we want to make the window very big like this so we can have a lot of fresh air up here, you know guys. So tell me how this looks, do you like it so far? Yeah, the bed will be turned like this and then we'll have bigger, even bigger space to turn around the space. So, after the glasses are put, I believe it's going to be looking very nice with the chandelier right here. It's going to be looking fantastic. The other reason we want to change the door, you can see all the mistakes that were made simply because I didn't know what they were doing and I couldn't even stand up for myself so the angle lines are all very lame even this car thing is very 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 weak you know see it is very weak they couldn't remove it because i wanted a sliding door which initially the ones who were working the ones who made this door told me they could not make a sliding door because my space was small but then guess what when I talked to these guys, they were like, oh no, the sliding space is actually possible. So we had to change the door. So I'm going to sell the metal, the, these other things, but that one will stay because I believe it's nice. They will just change the burglar designs to make it a little bit more safer because I already told you we have thieves around here. So. Basically, that's how it's all looking. Um, what else have I not shown you? I think I've shown you everything that you need to see, guys. Um, so, I may not be able to give oh. you other updates after this because, honestly speaking, um, I'm out of funds for the house specifically because you know when you're working, it needs to, you know, a bit more money than just this small small money of daily so we may have to do other content as we look for more money to finish up the house uh there's a lot going on now, yeah. yeah so apparently that's why we had to change the doors that's why we had to make new doors and the new window because they're not safe they're not secure and also there were very 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 many mistakes even for the kitchen window, you can see there's a lot of mistakes that were made. You, you can see, basically, it's not that safe. So these guys are going to be fixing everything like really in brand new. See this pipe. 
So the work was very rough, but thankfully they said they can retrieve it and make it a better space. So how is the kitchen? <laughs> Rate it out of 10, please. So that being said, I may not be able to give you guys updates on the house for a particular period of time, maybe, I don't know. God knows better. Because we, I am out of funds because I've had to incur extra big costs like the door and windows. Those cost me really, really, really so much money to fix and to buy material and also the time it takes for me to install them is a bit longer time than I expected it would be. But we're going to be doing other content of course. So you guys stay tuned and make sure you watch and make sure you support your girl. I don't know what else you need to know but um, yeah basically that's, that's, that's what we've done so far. Hope you like it. Uh, unfortunately very many things are getting spoiled. We have like very 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 many things that we will need to replace after like my couch is spoiled. The coffee table right there is all spoiled like nearly falling apart the other side is spoiled um this coffee table is also spoiled like the edges even down the rats are eating it like here yeah? so basically there's just so much that is going on but we are working with what we can otherwise i hope you have yourself a very beautiful easter holiday with your family and uh, i'll see you in another one thank you bye